Chris, you have a really strong senior class this year with a lot of experience, and the junior class um, adds to a group of upperclassmen that's a lot bigger than you had last year with a lot more experience. Can you talk about what it's like to have so many leaders with so much experience on your team? Yeah, I mean, um, like you said, last year we only had one senior and, you know, pretty big class of uh, juniors. So this year we've got four really, really strong seniors, and this is our fourth year together, and we're super tight-knit, and it's just great to be able to have those people next to you. Um, when you're trying to lead a team and the juniors, all three of them are just amazingly strong individuals and it's with you know the seven of us all together it's been a really really big help and really awesome to have all of us work together as a big unit to help um, guide these underclassmen. So. Great. From what you've seen in the gym so far this year, what do you think the biggest strengths of the team are going to be this year? What are the things to watch for in this coming season? Um, well, like we said last year we only had one senior so we only lost one routine on every event. So pretty much our entire lineups are coming back on every event except for one spot, which everyone's fighting for. And that doesn't mean the rest of our spots are locked in either. So we're all fighting for those six spots because we have a huge class of five really strong freshmen who came in. And, you know, our uh, sophomores from last year have gotten even stronger and even more consistent and confident from last year. So we've got a really, really strong underclass pushing us. So everyone's working really hard to come in. Um, I think we're going to be a lot, we're going to be really strong on vault this year. We're going to have a lot stronger floor team, and we've always been strong on bars and beams, so we're just going to keep rocking that and go with it this year.